o'clock. Now we're getting somewhere. 27.5 Celsius. It's about 245, 48.8 Celsius. Four o'clock in the afternoon, the first day. Didn't go great, but you know, this is this the way these things go. You gotta get to the bottom of it little by little. 4.30 Sunday afternoon. That was 49 Celsius. Let's see what it is. So it started dropping. So it's about 4.30 in the morning. And it's sitting at 26.7 Celsius. So it looks like we're sitting at about 24 Celsius. 7 o'clock in the morning. So it kept dropping. It's at 20 now. 8 o'clock update. It kept dropping. All right, it's compounding. Not a whole lot, but it's 1 o'clock and it's 52 now. So it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. It's actually 3 o'clock though. I forgot they changed the time yesterday. <laughs> 51 I was at 52 uh, so that was it 52 was the max the sand drain worked perfect that glue was great too first I was a little worried, worried that I might not be able to get it loose but I was able to get it chipped off with this chisel got the screws loose that sand all poured out it just poured out like a freak of water for a watch So that detail worked great. So with my new calculations at five watts per pound of sand, this is the sand battery that I originally got my idea from. It's in Finland. Invented by Polar Knight Energy. Wattage per pound on the sand. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. I'm going to cut this down to about 34 gallons. Which means taking out that oven air, uh, section. It'll work out about perfect. Because this, this has got a little bit of an inset. I'm hoping that that will fit right in here. There she is. Didn't take too long. Got to patch up these, the seam with that cement stuff. I think it'll be all right. So it's approximately a 35 gallon 